What's up, guys? How you doing? Uh, as you can read from the title, I'm doing something different today. Um, I'm outside the uh, my coin shop out here in Vegas. And, you know, I've been thinking, right? All I do is buy, 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 buy all the time, right? And I've never sold anything, and I, I never really planned on selling any, anything. But I want to try something different, right? I'm not a big uh, platinum fan, to be honest, and it's going to be hard for me to sell my silver and gold. So I'm going to try to sell some platinum today, right? I'm going to sell uh, a couple of ounces of, of platinum and see what happens. Uh, platinum is up today. And I, I believe and I'm a firm believer in buying low and selling high, you know, buying on the dip. And, um, you know, as of this recording, you see the price is over a thousand bucks for platinum. So I'm going to see if these guys are going to put their money where their mouth is because they're always talking about they got the best prices and blah, blah, blah. So I'm going to go in here and see what I can get. Um, I've never sold anything before. I've never did it in these five plus months or four months, five months since July. So August, September, October, November. So about almost five months, I guess. Um, I've never sold anything. So let's see what happens. I'm going to go talk to my boy, Nick. And let's see what happens. I'm very interested, man. Very interested to see this. Uh, about 30 minutes later, after some intense negotiations, I got my platinum sold. Um... Boy, they tried to really lowball me in the beginning, guys. Holy crap. They really tried to lowball me. Um, ask price and bid price um, were two different numbers. And they were trying to go 60 below the lowest number. And I said, no way, man. No way. And we kept talking and going back and forth. And I told him, I said, look, man, um, I understand that you got to make money. <clears throat> then he was trying to explain to me that, hey, oh, look at that Lambo. We see cars like this all the time out here. But anyways, um, I told him, I said, I know you guys got to make money. And he's trying to explain to me that, hey, you know, uh, platinum hasn't been over a thousand since such and such, such and such. I said, I get that. And I understand that. But you already know platinum is usually more expensive than gold. And platinum is like 30 times more rare than gold. You know, and I get it. You know, you got to make money. And I know you're a salesman, but I'm a salesman too, damn it. And you're going to get over one of me. So. Listen, man, I said, I'm not taking less than 2000 And we kept going back and forth. I said, all right, well, I'm, I'm getting up. All right, no problem. I'll go somewhere else. Somebody's going to take this. He goes, all right, all right, man. I said, dude, I'm probably going to give you back the money anyways. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to buy some stuff from you, which I did, by the way. And I'll show you this in, on the later, in, in a little bit later. But anyways, I said, uh, yeah, so let's do it. So I did this for a couple of reasons. One, for you for you guys' uh, entertainment and also to, for you guys can learn, I can learn. And also, too, um, I just wanted to experience it. And honestly, I'm not a big platinum guy anyways. Um, so I did it for an experiment. I'm not going to sell my gold and silver unless I have an, uh, an investment that I want to do and I need the fiat cash to do that. And that's why I have it for investment purposes savings purposes, investment purposes, and also a hedge on inflation and um, insurance. That's what I use it for as an insurance. So, all right, I'll show you what I got when I get back to the house, guys. But yeah, $2,000 for 2.1 ounces of platinum. All right, guys, just left the bank and the Eagle has landed. We got the cash, uh, the Fiat. Uh, quick little side note. Um, the reason why I didn't take it in cash at the place and they gave me a check is because um, they they uh, have a bank or they have an account with uh, Wells Fargo. That's the bank. And if you if they said the amount of money that it was, it was too much to just give you cash without charging you five percent. So you already know we ain't we ain't paying no five percent. Because 5% of $2,000 is another $100 off. And that was just defeated the purpose. So I said, yeah, give me the check. And fortunately, Wells Fargo, um, because they have an account with them, with them, uh, they don't charge any um, any fees or you don't have to have an account with them. Because I don't have an account with Wells Fargo. So, yeah, there you have it. I got, uh, got the $20,000 bills in fiat. Broke basically even uh, on the exchange. 
Uh, but that's why we buy this stuff, man. So we can hold our, um, our value and store our value with our, with our cash and our fiat. So I'm gonna go ahead and deposit this and today's the first. Um, so I got to pay my rent today. Is that why I sold this? Is that why I sold it? Cause I lost money and lost wages. Is that why you guys don't think that, do you? <laughs> Anyways. All right, I'll, I'll uh, see you at the house and show you what I got. All right, guys, we're back home, and this is what I got. Nothing nothing major, just one gram silver. Now, as you know, the silver price went up today, and this is what we got. One gram, triple nines. I got the American flag. I got six of those, and I got this. Let me show you. It's really small though. It's really hard to see. But yeah, I think it's some kind of buffalo on it or something. Yep, so three nines fine. One grammars, and I got one of these. So when I first when I sold the um when I sold the platinum, um I was talking to Nick. Now Nick didn't want to give me my deal. He was the one that was giving me problems. But anyways. So <clears throat> after I uh, did this, did the deal, um, I went over. I said, "Let me see what you got." And he was like, "Oh, the prices went up." I said, "Yeah, I know, Nick. I know." So I said, "What are these?" And he showed me these. I said, "You know what I want? The, either these or the, you know, the um, foreign, um, you know, coins, you know." So you know what I'm talking about these. <clears throat> And so uh, he's like, oh, those are a dollar a piece. I said, a dollar a piece? I said, how much they weigh? He said, a gram. I said, well, that would be $31.10 a piece then at an ounce. He said, yeah, I know with a fraction. I said, come on, bro. He goes, eight bucks. So I said, I'll give you seven. He was like, okay, okay. <laughs> so I got eight of these grams for seven bucks. So not bad. So there you have it, guys. My first sale today. My first ever selling of a precious metal. Probably won't be my last. And yeah, let me know what you guys think in the comment section below. And do me a favor, guys. If you like this video, uh, don't be shy. Hit that like button. You ain't got to smash it. You don't got to kill it. Just tap it lightly, okay? Because, guys, I'm sharing stuff with you. I shared this. I shared my freaking cash. I shared the check. I shared the shop. I'm sharing everything. So do me a favor. Since I'm sharing, share this video, all right? Because we already know <laughs> sharing is caring. You guys also know I love you guys very much. I love all you guys. I really appreciate your time and watching. I really do. All right? I'll talk to you guys soon. Peace and love, guys.